So over here, you can see that I have a project right here, just like this. And at times, what you may want to do is you may want to add in markers in different parts of the clips right here um, uh, so that you, you can go around and remember what those particular parts are for. So in that case, what you can do is you can go around over here onto any part where you want to add in the marker and then press M on your keyboard and then the marker is added as you can see right here. You can go around over here and double click on the marker to change its color over here. And you can also go around over here and change around the name of the marker as well. So let's say, for example, uh, let's say this is going to be the beginning uh, of a clip right here, just like this. And what you can also do is you can go around onto different parts of the videos right here, just like this, and then add in markers by clicking on this button right here. So you can go around over here, double click, and then choose out a color right here. And then what you can do is you can rename uh, this out and say, uh, trim this video so you can go around and add in marks over here as well and then you can define up the time of the marker over here as well just like this by typing it over here just like this so this is what you have as you can see over here so that so that is the marker you can go around over here onto other parts right here and add in a marker right here just like this and then this is what you have this is the marker as you can see but if i were to go around and double click you can see that duration is an option as well so if i were to go around and pre uh, press let's say for example four right here just like this so here you can see, let me just say four right here and press done right here. Then you can see that I get a four second long marker right here. You can also go around and then resize this out by clicking and dragging this. And you can see that you can go around and mark out a range over here as well. And just like with any other markers, you can go around, change its color over here and add in notes over here and associate keywords with it as well. So that is how you can add in markers inside of a project inside of DaVinci Resolve. So I hope you guys learned something as always. And as always, please like, comment, share and subscribe.